Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is going to be um, a different kind of video. It's actually um, directed to a specific person. And it's for all of you to hear and gain the knowledge, but it's it's for specifically um, someone that I, I'm having a very heavy heart about her right now. And, um, and it's important that um, I talk to her because, um, well, let me just, let me just explain. So, um, WV is, um, West Virginia Prepared Mine. Um, we call her Kim or WV. Most of us call her WV or, you know, I've sometimes referred to her as, as mama because she was, during the Shauna days, she was, um, mama. She was like the mama bear to everybody. And everybody adored her and still do because she, she portrayed the mama. She always had good advice. She always had positivity and, and, and she's a, she's a very good woman. And if it wasn't for her, um, and a few other people, but mainly her that stepped forward, um, when I was unmodded and felt it safe at that point to to share with me what had taken place during the time of my husband's passing. So back when my husband passed away three years ago, um, I didn't have my, in the beginning I had my immediate family that flew out here and they were with me for a couple of days. And they talked to me on the phone if I called them, you know, for the first week or two. But after that, it all stopped because I'm in search for the father. I'm in search for truth. I'm, I'm following my father the way you should, or the way I believe I should. And so basically I was alone and, but I thought I had this amazing group. And this is for all of you that are new to learning about all of this. These steps are important for you to know. That's why you should go back to the very first video I did of Mark Google of Adam back in um, August, but um, it's important to say that here I belonged to this amazing channel. I didn't ask to be modded. He modded, Adam modded me out of the blue. And I really thought I was a part of something amazing and beautiful. And when my husband passed away, I couldn't figure out for the life of me why nobody would talk to me. The, meaning the mods, because we were really tight. It wasn't like his show would come on and we would all go in there and mod. No, we would meet in Discord in a meeting room and we would all be on there with ears and, and eyes watching the channel, looking for people causing problems and stuff. But we would all be talking to each other at the same time. All of us, or at least most of us mods. And um, it, it, we became... Per, we, we started to become kind of close and then Shauna, I'm not going to go into all the Shauna detail because you can hear that in my other videos, but Shauna, um, had been brought in and she was doing amazing things for the channel. Although they were different, um, it was helping his channel a lot. And then, um, in walks Dex and I call his wife the beast. So when I, you hear me say Dex and the beast. I'm talking about his wife and why do I say that? Because the woman has demons in her and I'm not saying that to be spiteful or mean. She has, she has an anger in her that is not, that is never happy. It's always wanting more and more and more. And, um, all I know is that my spirit didn't like her spirit. I tolerated her, but I knew that inside my spirit did not like her spirit. And, but so when you hear me refer to Dex and the Beast, that's what I'm talking about. His wife, Lex. Well, her real name is Michelle, but online she's um, Lex with Dex or something. Anyway, when they came in, all of a sudden Adam's channel, Farm Google, TV and News became like a corporate type deal, right? It was really, it became really strange, really odd, but we dealt with it. And Dex really came in to put data mining software into the Mark Google channel so that you can be data mined, which means they get all your information, anything you say, anything you type, all of it, your location, everything 
is captured and put in a database where that can be sold to whoever wants it. It could be a retailer, it could be um, government, it could be um, another country, whoever had the highest bidder. Well, Shauna found out about this. And um, in all of my videos leading up to this, um, I was finding out about all this in this last couple of months, you guys. I didn't know any of this. In doing my videos, truth has been coming to light after video after video after video, okay? So now I can kind of sum it up for you. So Shauna was asked, um, you know, what were her goals and this and that. And when she realized that they wanted her to sell her quiet, her, her, um, her, her morals, her ethics, her, her um, Americanization, you know, just get, you know, sell it all and go along with this data mining, sell out Christian, sell out your fellow man, sell out your fellow American, and you'll be sitting pretty on some money because Adam's sitting pretty on $6 million right now because he sold out. Shauna said no. And from that point on, it was just hell for her. She left the channel, or should I say Dex pushed her out, but she also left because she wouldn't have nothing to do with it. And because of an NDA, she couldn't share any of this with anybody, she thought, because Adam broke the NDA first. When he spoke to me and showed me her text messages, he broke the NDA first. But they attacked her. We attacked her. All lots attacked her, okay? And she finally just... Her, her, her life was threatened. Her parents' lives were threatened. She was being told constantly to kill herself. She's an Air Force veteran, okay? And these people are telling her to kill herself. Adam, Dex, and Lex, they're all telling her to kill herself because they did not want her to tell anybody about the data mining, okay? So all of my videos are leading up to all of this. And, and then there's so much more about Adam's character and Dex's character and, and our involvement. So I didn't know any of this at all as far as um um when my husband died and why the mods wouldn't talk to me why you know i thought you know there's got to be a reason why they're not calling me or why they don't answer the phone when i call i never really put it together because i couldn't believe that people could be that mean-spirited or mean-hearted and so what i thought were a lot of friends that were mods really weren't they were all talking behind my back and the 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 things were being said by by Adam Dex and Lex and Jay Stone. Jay Stone seventy eight was the one that they used to go out and perpetrate the lies on me and tell everyone about me, saying that you know I was money hungry and I didn't need to go fund me and I was using go fund me to you know that I was greedy and I was using my husband's death to get money from the Kugel family and I started my own go fund me after they took mine down and. They just told a whole bunch of lies. And I didn't know about any of this until recently. And back in August, um, Adam and Dex unmodded me. I was their one of their longest mods. Whitetail Seven was the first was the first mod, then there was a couple other, and then there was me, but the a couple other got um ousted out. Um and so I, I was like right right up there with, with with Whitetail Seven. And Whitetail Seven Whitetail Seven was never involved because she was never brought into the into the conference rooms. So she was just modding. She had no idea any of this was going on. Okay. And bless her heart that she was able to to stay away from it. The father protected her from all this garbage. But I did not know every time I'd go into the Discord room to talk with them all. I did not know that before I came in the room that they were all talking about me and it was all lies. It was all fabricated lies, but they believed it. And, um, when WV, when they unmodded me in August and WV and, and, and TJ, um, Trucker and, and Snafu Snaps and a few other mods, when they came forward and told me, they said they couldn't tell me before because I was a mod and, when they came forward and started telling me all the, all these things, they were cooperating each other. I was just floored, you guys. I was just floored. And you might say, well, what you didn't know didn't hurt you. 
when somebody tells you these things and you go back and during that time and the feelings you had and the questions you had and everything is answered, it's like darts in your heart and it, it's very hurtful. It's very hurtful. I still, it still makes me cry. So the strength that I have is by doing these videos one by one, exposing the things that I'm finding out. And WV was experiment was, um, was, um, detrimental to me finding all this out. She was one of the main people because I knew nothing until she did her video. And when I saw her video, I was floored because I had no idea that it went even deeper than just me. And as I'm doing these videos, you know, WV has had my back. I mean, she's been, you know, when people are really harsh with me in comments, she'll go and stick up for me like mama bear. And she's a really, really good person. And it really, it's, this is really heavy on my heart because um, a few days ago or last week, I guess I did a video and I clipped out a part of her video um, to put in this video because, because I'm showing a pattern and how this YouTuber says this and so did a she and, and so on and so on to show a pattern of, of Adam. Okay. And, um, of his integrity, of his lies, of his, just everything. And she came into my comments and, um, said that, you know, she took her video down because she didn't want to be involved anymore or whatever she said. And then, and then she said, you know, um, that she didn't want, um, that she put her video on private for this and that. Anyway, um, I got really, I got really offended because how do you, in my mind, I thought, how do you put the truth out there and then tell somebody when you tell somebody all these horrible things that were done to them behind the back and then turn around and tell them, oh, but you can't talk anymore. Oh, and that's not what she's saying, but pretty much that's what, that's what she's saying in my mind. And WV, I know that's not what you mean. What you mean is you don't want me to use your video, but your video is the truth is talking about what they did to you and to homegrown and to, and to a lot of people, but to put it out and then say, you know, oh, you know, let me, let me put the, let me put the, you know, ketchup back in the bottle. You know, you can't unring a bell. You rang that bell and you can't unring it. I'm not going to unhear what I heard. I'm not going to unsee what I saw. And, and putting all this together, there is still a lot that needs to be said. And I, and I feel really bad because I, I know that that probably hurt you because for whatever reason, you want that video to go away. You don't want no one to know that you made it and you want it just to go away. Now, I don't know if you're back talking with Dex and Lex and, and Adam. I don't know if you're doing it because CJ's begging you because they got dirt. Well, they don't have to get to her. She's already, you know, pinwheeled eyed to them. But I do know that after a few times that you and I have talked that we haven't really talked on the phone that much. And that's because CJ's got in your ear and you're going to say, no, 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 she, nobody's got my ear, honey. You know, I may have been naive back then, but my eyes are open now. And you know, I'm sorry that my videos are, are hurting you. And what I can say to you is don't come to my channel. Don't watch my videos. If they're going to hurt you, because I don't want to hurt you, WB. You've been good to me. You've been nothing but a kind, wonderful woman to me. And you've been like a protector. You've been like a big sister. And after you told me all the things that you told me, WB, you know, I'm not going to lie. I was hurt by you too, because you could have told me back then what was going on and you didn't. You stayed quiet, just like everybody else. Maybe you didn't join in their reindeer games against me, but you certainly knew everything that was going on. You could have stopped this way sooner, but I forgive you for all that because you came clean. You came clean with all of it and you told me the truth. And I love you very much for that. That's why when 
you come in my channel and stuff and the snaps goes after you. I tell them, stop it. I don't like him picking on you because I really do care for you. But to ask me now, to ask me now, WB, to be quiet, to ask me now not to include your video. I'm not including you. I'm including your video, the truth of your video that matches up with everything I'm finding out. It's not right to do. It's not the right thing to do. You need to let me do what I'm doing. And if it bothers you, don't watch. Because I'm not hurting anybody except the people that are involved in, in, in the whole data mining. What is going to happen to Christians? Because I don't care what Dex is telling them. Monty's telling them, oh, no, it's just for retailers to target, you know, people that like this or like that or, or this product or that product. That may be so right now, but pretty soon that system is the beast system. That's how they're going to track and find us. So I don't care what story he's spinning on it. That's exactly what he invented. And that's exactly what he implemented in the in Marflugal News in the channel. That's why he got taken off Discord because Discord banned him for life because he tried to implement that software in there and they caught him. They kicked him out for life. That's why he was banned from Discord, Marvugal TV. But you know all of this. And you, you want to take back a video that's warning people? Warning other Christians? You're a Christian woman. Now, I don't claim Christianity because I believe it's all religion and religion is all man-made. I claim the Father. That is it. I claim Yeshua and my father, period. They are, the, they are the ones that I talk to. They're the ones that I pray to, straight to them. There's no middleman. There's no in between. There's no religion. None of that BS. Because the disciples back in the day followed the way. They, they, they weren't, they were called Christians because that's what the Pharisees called them. So if you want to label yourself a Christian or whatever, that by, do whatever you feel is right for you. I follow my father and I have no religion. Neither is he. He's not going to come down and pick a religion. He's going to come down and pick the people that follow him. And, but since you identify as a Christian, I'm telling you, as a Christian woman, how can you unring that bell? How can you tell me, tell people now, you don't want your video shown. You don't want no one to, 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 um, I'm not trying to look at all my past videos. I could have made a ton of money. I know what target areas I could have hit and I could have made a ton of money. You know how many brides are out there that would love someone like me to tell them how to do their own wedding because, because of the whole COVID thing. They're down to like 50 person weddings, 20 person weddings, and they love ideas. I could have started a whole sec doing all that because I'm an ace at it. And I'm not shy to say I'm an ace at it. I know all the ins and outs, where to get things the cheapest, how to buy this and buy that, and where to go to do this and that, no matter where you live. And I could have gotten in that genre and I could be making bank right now, but that's not where the father led me. Okay. I'm not doing this for like subscribes and hit the bell at all. The only time I told people to, to, to sub to me was when I started my, my second channel. I think a week or two ago, I told everyone to go sub because that's where I'm going to do the marathon of all the videos for people just coming in, learning the truth. But, you know, I'm not doing this for money, WV. I'm not doing this for clout. I'm not doing this for anything. I'm doing this to Adam, Dex, and Lex and their mods. And I'm not really attacking the mods, but it is what it is. They're involved. They're involved. And anytime they're involved, I'm going to mention them. But I'm not trying to do it to hurt them. I'm trying to do it to wake them up. But I'm not doing this to grade, gain traction for my channel. I'm not doing it. If you look at all my videos, all I've ever said was I don't give a damn about like, subscribe, and hit the bell. And there's a lot of people that have watched me for a long time that can attest to that. Okay, am I monetized now? Well, it says that I am, but this still takes months because they got to do other approvals and they're probably not going to approve me because I'm not really selling anything. I'm not really advocating for anything to be advertised on my channel. So I, I doubt, maybe I won't. But that's besides the point, WV. You're wanting to unring a bell that you rung already. You can't do that. You cannot do that. You, 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 you did your video and, and 
people are waking up because of your video. And now you want to hide it like it never happened? What are you going to say to the father when he says, you know, Kim, why did you hide your video? You put it out there to warn people. I put that in your spirit to do that. And then you, and then you took it away. Why? These are all the people that didn't get to, to, to wake up, that didn't get to, to see the truth because you took your video away. So, so I'm really, I'm really sad WV because when, when I did that video and then you went and commented, I deleted your comments because I didn't want that negativity on my channel. The people that they're trying to bring back, you know who they are. We don't say their names because this isn't about any of them. Everything goes directly to Adam. And, and it's for Dex and Lex too, because they were the ones that brought it all in here. So when somebody does something, they use a fake channel name. You know, they make a ghost um, channel or whatever you call it. A sock account is what they call it, I think. And then they come in and attack me. I don't care who it is. It's Adam. When they attack me to defend Adam, Dex, or Lex, or the Fool fam, it's Adam. See, and that's what they don't understand. They, they're carnal. And they say, that wasn't Adam. I made that channel and blah, blah, blah. So you're coming after me talking about me having ventures and, and saying these mean things? For what purpose? Because of Adam. So instead of directing it to the people coming and, and going against me, I take it straight back to him. There's no fighting that. I'm not going to fight individuals. I'm not going to do that because that's what they're used to. And because I'm not doing that, they don't know what to do with me. Because I'm speaking straight truth. And because they think carnal and not spiritual, they have no idea how to fight against that. Absolutely no idea. Because it's not in them. The father's not in them. They mock him by saying, oh, your father told you. They, they mock him. So I don't have time for them. They, this, this isn't about them. This is about Adam. It all comes from him. He let Dex in. He let the beast in. Now the beast system is in his channel. And God help anybody that clicks on his show. Because the moment you go into his channel, you're being tracked. So I don't understand why you want to unring that bell. WV. I don't. And it, and, it, and it's really hurtful because when you and JP and Snafu and the, and I can't say the other people, but when they all told me the truth and started sharing everything and then all the pieces started falling into place and then I go back and I find Iggy's, you know, stuff and, and, and I know what happened to him and, and, and I start, I never listened to Iggy before. Never heard it, heard what he was saying. We were there. We were listening, but I, I wasn't listening to him. I was blinded to it all, just like everybody else. But now I can hear him. He's saying the same thing three years ago that I'm just finding out now. I can tell you all this. I'm not a backstabber, and I am not wishy-washy, and I don't go back and forth. I'm telling you the truth the way I know it as I'm finding it out. And the things I already knew from before. But you will not see me go back and forth. You know. First against Adam. Then for him. The only thing I'm for is them turning to the father. That's it. So when you hear me speak kind words to them. It's because I'm trying to turn them to the father. That's it. But you will not see me supporting him. His channel. You will not see me. You know. Saying, well, I understand he had to do what he had. No, I am not going back and forth. You will not see my videos being taken down unless YouTube takes it down. You're only going to get the truth from me because I do not, I am not a traitor. I do not go back and forth. So WV, I'm, I'm sorry if my videos hurt you. And I'm not trying to hurt you in any, any sense of the imagination. I'm using your video to expose who they are and what they did. And there are a lot more people involved than just you. 
there was a lot more people involved than just Shauna. We all had different targets on our back with different names. And I'm exposing all of it. And all I can say is that when I have to use your video, I am going to use it. And I'm not doing it to hurt you. I'm using it to expose them because you put it out there. You chose to put the truth out there. And now that you put the truth out there, you can't take it back. You know, so I, you know, I don't, I don't know what else to say to you. You know, I'm, I'm sorry if it hurts you. I'm sorry if you're offended. I'm sorry, you know, that I'm not, I'm not going to try and put the genie back in the bottle. It's out and it's, and it's going to finish until it's done. So I hope this clarifies things because some of you were on that live stream when she came in and probably wondered why did I delete her comments? Because there will be no negative comments on my channel in regards to me or what I'm doing. There will be no comments in favor of Adam, Dex, Lex, or the Marfugal family. You cannot come in my channel and use it as your platform to speak. And this is for everybody. You cannot do that. Not with my channel. This is my platform. It is not your platform to come in and, and defend Adam. I won't allow it. I'll delete it. My mods already know that it's not allowed on my channel. You have something to say, go to your own channel and say it there. My channel is my platform to speak the truth of what I know and what I'm finding out. So anybody coming to my channel thinking that they're going to speak their mind in defense of Adam, they're wrong. It will not happen on my channel, period. If you want to speak your mind, go to your own channel and do it there, but you're not going to do it on my channel. There's no defense for, for them. There's no relief for them because what they have done and continue to do is horrific. What they're doing is against our father. It's against the American people and it is against our way of life. And when you realize what that B system is, the tracking us, I always wondered, didn't you always wonder how they were going to find us all? The entire world is tracked now because of what Dex invented and other people invented it with them, but so what his name's on there too. And because of that, that's how you're all going to be found. So my videos are not to hurt anybody they are to expose them the fugal mods and adam dex and lex nothing more nothing less and i'm going to continue to do it and wv if it hurts you please don't come to my channel and don't watch it but please don't ask me to stop do not ask me to use what i need to to expose them it was put in your heart to tell me the truth, and you did. And I thank you for that. But don't tell me now to shut up and to stop, because that's not the right thing to do, WV. Thank you all for listening.